Well, hey guys, welcome to the channel. Glad you're here. Glad you're stopping by. I'm going to cover this a little bit because I want you guys to go to better sources, but I want to let you be aware of it because I think it is really important. Now, there's a lot of people in our community, rather it be the frauditors, the anti frauditors, the flat earthers, the gamers, the influencers, or the kick streamers, whatever. There are some bad people in every single group. Some of them are just wolves in sheep's clothing. We found out a little bit about Welsh News Network, and that's still going on. But there's one in particular that really caught me that Shiz Happens and Kate found. Um, there's a, there is a person in our community, and I hate to say this because I thought he was a nice person. Um, I thought he was just quirky, and, you know, he's had nice words, and I've had nice words to him. But come to find out, He's a little bit more disingenuous and he's hiding something that is pretty bad. It's pretty bad. Now, one thing you could probably find out, and I always like for me, like when I see people in this community, I automatically think there's something fishy going on here. And when I found out, I wasn't completely surprised, but um, we have Oleg. Oleg. Um, let me go ahead and say this. You need to get help. Seriously, you need to get off YouTube. You need to get help now, like immediately. Um, what, what's going on here? And you can catch this on Shiz's stream. You can go to our Discord, check it out there. There is receipts. This is a real thing that's happening. Uh, I'm not going to show them on here because they get the credit for doing this. Uh, I'm just going to give you guys the information to go check it yourself to make your own opinion. Um, but Oleg has actually been caught um, talking to a minor or multiple minors, um, which is not a good thing. There's a few things in this world that I hate more than anything. And one of them is pedophiles. And I also hate people who use mental health as a way to scapegoat or manipulate other people. Um, it's not funny. It's not fucking funny at all. Um, they found out that Oleg has a sketchy past when he's talking to uh, minors um, in sexual ways which you shouldn't be doing, shouldn't be doing. I don't care if they're 16 or 18. Like, I, I would think it's weird if you're talking to an 18, 19-year-old like that uh, as a 30-year-old dude. Uh, but then again, you know, that's just me. Um, you know, we all have skeletons in our closet. Some of them are worse than others, but this is pretty fucking bad. This is really bad. Um, and it's not looking good uh, at all. And like I said, you can check out the evidence on the Discord server. Uh, to find out yourself. Uh, you don't have to trust me. If you don't like this video, be sure to just let me know. I know a lot of people um, probably like Oleg. And, you know, part of me thinks maybe he's a good person, but I cannot justify him after this. Um, so, like I said, I, I'm not going to talk to a pedophile. I'm not going to talk to a child diddler. I'm not going to do it. Uh, I have no respect for those people. I know some of them uh, in my area. And I have no respect for him. All I'm, automatically, me, I'm thinking like, oh, you're a pedophile. Um, castration, like castration, just cut your dick off. Um, and, you know, if you're a girl and you're being a child predator, then cut your tits off, I guess. <laughs> I don't know. I don't know. I don't know. Um, don't do that. Don't fucking do that. Why? Why is it like we're having a lot of people coming out in the community that we trust turns out to be real human pieces of garbage? On top of that, like the weird, crazy thing, the crazy thing, and I'm all about mental health. Uh, we talk about it a lot. I've had people in my life that's committed suicide. I've almost committed suicide. I've been in and out of the hospital, mental health wards and everything. Um, you can actually go see that and get it verified. Um, one of the things some people do when they get caught in um, a serious issue, one of the ways they deflect is using mental health as a, an excuse. In this case, Oleg basically threatened to kill himself. That's suicide baiting. Uh, that's really terrible. That's a deflection. That's manipulation. Uh, that would make you a narcissist. You're trying to use something that some people are strongly against in your way of trying to get out of your current situation. It's not cool, dude. Not cool, especially to me. Not cool at all. Like, I've got after a lot of people for saying stuff like that. I've got after people telling people to kill themselves. Uh, we did that with Turtle Boy a long time ago when he was trying to tell some guy that was a drug dealer 
or something like that to kill himself. Some kid will sell drugs, which, you know, that's bad on its own, but don't tell someone to kill themselves. Um, you know, I hate pedophiles. I do. I hate pedophiles. I hate rapists. Um, I hate all kinds of stuff like that. I don't like it. It's terrible. I don't want them to immediately get killed uh, unless they really, really fuck up. I want them to get the most they need <laughs> impacted by the justice system, like severely, like they need to just punish the fuck out of these people. Um, but in a society, pedophiles do not belong. I think all of us together as a whole community, the whole internet, maybe not the whole internet because there's a lot of pedophiles on the internet, but I want to say a vast majority of people on the internet can probably come to the same conclusion that, hey, don't fuck with kids. Don't be a creep. Don't be that guy. You know, you're lucky Chris Anson's not busting through your doorway right now. And I hate to say that because, like I said, I thought Oleg was a decent person. Um... But you, like I said, you're you're coming to find out that people that you think are good people probably not are good people. Um, yeah, I mean it's it's bad, it's bad. I mean, there's it seems like every week something bad is coming out. Like, and it's it's a terrible fucking thing, and I hate it. I really do. I really do. And I hope you guys, I I go. I hope you guys take the time. To check out the evidence. I know some people are going to be like. Uh, that can't be right. You're trying to spread rumors. Falsifications. You're trying to stir up problems. I'm not. I'm not doing that. I've seen the evidence myself. Uh, it's pretty damning. Um, I'm sure he doesn't want you to see this stuff. Uh, but like I said. Go on Shiz Happens channel. Also check out the Discord. Under the Furry Fury. Um, it might change your mind. It will change your mind. Um. And I'm not making this video as a point to get your pitchforks out and go after him. I'm not going to do that. That would be no different than one of the frauders having their whole audience attack somebody. That's that's stupid too. And I don't want you to guys go and say, hey, go ahead and kill yourself. Don't do that. Don't fucking do that. Um, what happen, needs to happen, this dude needs help. He also needs uh, to be off the internet. He does need to be punished for it. Ob obviously, you just don't do that. Um, stay out of the furry community for fuck's sake. Don't do that. Don't do that at all. That's just cringe and creepiness all together. And I hate to say that, but you know, I think just like pedophiles, a lot of people on the internet don't like furries because we don't understand them. It's just, it's just weird. It's just really strange. Like I don't, I don't understand the concept of the concept of dressing up like a cat and getting fucked by a dude dressed up like a dog or something like that. That's fucking crazy. It's crazy, really crazy. Um, and you see a lot of people in that community like getting in trouble for talking to minors. It's everywhere. Yeah, I mean, you could do a quick Google search. And you could just say, "Hey, does furries like minors?" You're probably going to have a whole gigantic list of people's like cases where furries have done that. It's terrible. It's really terrible. And this is going to be really this 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 video might get demonetized, but. Um, I just wanted to give my thoughts on it. Um, I, I would keep an eye on at Shiz Happens. I would keep an eye on uh, the rest of the community. They're going to have way more stuff to talk about. It. I just wanted to give you guys a, a heads up of what is going on. Um, and, you know, if he comes out and says the same shit that I'm going to kill myself for this, um, definitely tell him not to do that. Um, if I see it, then I'll have to make another video about it. Um, but it's really terrible. It's really really bad. But all right, guys, I'll talk to you later.